here from Motor Boats Monthly today aboard Windy's brand new 29 Coho. Now this boat replaces Windy's very popular 28 Ghibli, so it's very important that they got this one right. What they've done is they've kept the same basic concept, in fact it's even got the same hull design, but this hull is now resin infused, but they've sharpened everything right up, so it's got the more modern portholes on it, they've gone for a really sharp spray finished hull as an optional extra which looks fantastic. It's a little bit longer because it's extended on the bathing platform, and the layout in the cockpit is the same, but again they've just changed details like this helm here which now has space for a chart bottom. Now normally you find these boats fitted with Volvo's diesel engines, which of course are very, very good, but this one's very interesting. This one's got Volvo's brand new 6 litre 380 horsepower engine with a Duopuff, of course. It's a very, very capable boat. We took this one out to some fairly rough water out at sea earlier, which is why I'm looking a little bit dishevelled. But with this engine in, it's absolutely fantastic. It's silky smooth and acceleration and performance more than live up to the handling of the boat. changed is down here where when you have got rid of the dinette that you used to get inside the Ghibli and instead of putting this big double berth in the front here. The logic to that is the fact that people rarely actually sit inside these boats but if you are overnighting this is a much more comfortable arrangement. The other thing that Windy have done is they've put in a really intelligent canopy system on which encloses the cockpit very quickly and very easily so that then becomes your day space. There's a little galley down here so you can make a bit of lunch if you're out for the day and most importantly there's a separate loo over on this side as well. So this is Windy's new clever canopy system. Basically you lift the engine hatch here. This whole canopy is stored in this area here. So you lift it like this, flip it over, and drop that one forward. And then all the side sections just literally slot into place. That means you can use this area as a day area even when the weather's not quite so clement. Windy have done a really great job with this boat. What they've done is they've kept all the best bits of the Ghibli, which was a fantastic boat in its own right, but they've brought it bang up to date. 